back and uh i started a brand here it is here's the brand you can check it out link in the description today we're gonna be talking about from the beginning of how to start a brand the tools what you need to do how you need to go about things but yeah i'm gonna tell you everything all right so when you want to start a brand you need to be creative obviously because if you're not creative then i mean I don't think your designs are gonna look that cool. So you need to start by creating a bunch of designs, you know, just expressing whatever you want on a blank. Photoshop or Procreate, though Procreate app is a good way to start. So first you design, you design an image, you design something, then you're like, hmm, I like this design. Then you have the design, right? Then you need to figure out if you want to direct to garment it, which is, you know, like printing it on it. Or you want to screen print it when it, which is like, you know, you can feel it. It's like screen printing, you know. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? You figure out how to go about, do, about doing that, you know. You can search on the, the Google Maps, wherever you're living. You can search up like screen printing or or a direct to garment printer in your area and you could talk to the best one that you feel is right for you and you could like figure out the pricing how many units you need for a good price and then before you go to them you need to figure out if you want to use their blanks a blank is i don't know a blank a blank is the hoodie or the shirt that you're going to use you could use their brands which is I don't know, these have Gildan or Al Style or something like that. Or you could use like a better quality, heavyweight, thick um, brand that makes makes a good hoodie or shirt like that you want, that feels comfy, that you think the customers will like, that you think you would want to wear, something that you would want to wear, something that you'd like to wear. So you figure out the blank that you want. Um, you buy as much as, as much as like the designs you're going to make. So you could get two hoodies. And then two designs on there, or like three hoodies, or four hoodies, and then four designs, or, or two shirts, two hoodies, four designs, you know what I'm talking about? Then you go to your local screen printer or direct to garment person, and you tell them, I want samples for this design on these blanks. So then you'll be like, and then they'll be like, okay, the samples are going to cost you this much. Sometimes it's free, but the samples usually cost. So then you can make a sample so you can look so you can see how it looks in person, how you can see how, how it feels, you know, the texture, the the screen printing quality, the or the direct environment quality. You have a sample. These samples are useful because you can take pictures to promote your brand when it's coming out. So you can like have a physical a physical um product of your brand to take pictures of, you know, ads and stuff like that, you know, modeling shoots, stuff like that. Bro, are they gonna keep talking? Anyway, I cannot make a video here. Like, what the fuck's going on? I haven't talked this much in a long time. Stupid. Okay, anyway, okay, so then you have a photos. You have your promotion photos, and you have, like, it all set up about how you want the brand to come out on your Instagram, your website. So then you start posting a little, little by little, so people know that you're coming out with something, and you promote those posts, and you target the specific audience you want. Anyway, this is what I did. I created an album of all the photos that I want to promote. I mean, all the photos that I had, and like the collects and the images, the photos that I was gonna promote. Okay. So then you decide what date you want to you want to release your brand. And then you go by one post, you're like releasing blah, 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 blah. And then the name of the collection, you know, you put one piece of the collection. And then you do this every, every like, couple of days, every day until the collection is released. You make, you can make like a video of like each piece for when it's live. Or you can make like a special um, design or something or image. To promote that it's live now and then people could go be like okay it's live now let's go to the website i just ran why am i talking so fast anyway 
you're watching this video, you already know some things, so I don't need to tell you everything. But there's a lot of ways to go by about okay. okay. There's a lot of ways to go about, you know, promoting your brand or coming out with your brand. And you know, you could do whatever you want. It's it's all about creativity and what you have, the resources you have. You don't need to buy, you don't need to spend a lot of money to to get like a photo shoot or to, you know, get models or, you know, something like that. You don't need to spend a lot of money, okay? What you need to do is be creative and use the resources you have around you and then your vision will come true. Trust me, it takes patience, it takes time, but everything will be all right. I think I said in this video is, you know, you could go about you could go about this by any way that you want. But you know, you could just take some advice that I said in this video. I know it was all over the place. I know it's talking kind of fast. But slow down the video or go rewind it and watch it again and see what I said. And then you could use some insight, some advice. You don't need to take all my advice. I don't really care, bro. I'm just trying to, you know, help y'all. And maybe I do help y'all. And if I did, you know, comment down below. If I didn't, then comment. I'm saying that. What were you talking about? I don't freaking know. But don't comment at all, okay? But yeah, I'm gonna be making more videos about this. This was just like my, of how i how, this was just like how I thought it was when I promoted my stuff. I barely began, you know, I'm still a beginner too. This all takes practice, you know, it's patience. Patience is key. And it'll all come to you in time. You'll learn a lot. I'm still learning too, but yeah. This is what I learned and I'm telling you guys what I learned and what I've, you know, seen throughout releasing my collection, which is out now, link a bio, release my brand. I'll show you guys some pieces right now. Have you seen these, this piece? It's a red star, it says Wasted Dreams three times. And then I have uh, this one, which is the, the Target Star Wasted Dreams. Get out, I'll put some pictures up here. Okay, and then you can check it out, link below. And my Instagram is down there too. My brand's Instagram, my personal Instagram. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Um, I'm gonna post once a week or twice a week. Comment down below what videos you guys wanna see, like the video. I'm really gonna try to post now. I'm gonna take this stuff serious. I'm gonna post twice a week or once a week, all right? All right? Trust me, I am gonna post.